to. So anyway, before we get into the tr the pop culture trivia, do you want to talk about um my Instagram never came back. Deleted forever. No, not that. Not that. Not that. The sh the whole Shane stuff because a lot oh. developed since last you were on. Yeah, but you kind of like your your H Street Live is like the after show for front of me. <laughs> That's why I watch it. I'm always like, oh, okay, I just keep following up. Yeah, I mean, you guys the, go I had, harder on there. There I was like it. there was just so much to talk about. I mean, honestly, the, there's nothing much to talk about. Ryland's a little weasel. They they are gonna get away with the shit. They're gonna glaze over it because they're rich and they'll keep being successful. And um, they lied. Ryland's a weasel. He lied. No one cares about your podcast. That's the only way it got views. Turn off the comments. Silence your viewers. No one like that. It's gonna go down. Your podcast will be over. Soon. Could I make a comment on his podcast? It's called the sip. It's like, could you try a little fucking harder? <laughs> The sip. It's the like si it's like there's uh, so many variations of tea styled <laughs> podcasts and shows. The sip, the tea, the 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 steam, the, the yeah. steam, the sesh. Yeah, there's this. I've never heard the sip though. Like, sorry, dude, that's just not cutting it. We gotta. The sip, and also he's just like, I love that the sip is all about drama, and he's like, I hate drama, and also this is not fucking drama. This is something I told you guys as a friend that like affected me. I didn't yeah. hear any drama. I don't hate Jeffrey. I didn't hate you guys. You guys just started becoming mean, and then all this other shit. By the way, I didn't even tell you this. Like all this other shit. Well, probably it doesn't matter. Who cares? But I got, I started getting voice memos from people over the years of Shane shit talking to me, like his actual audio. I didn't put it out there because I thought it was kind of weird. But I oh, recap what he said, and he basically like heard from Shane's. This is the first time I heard it because like Peter Mon said that he called me a soci. Oh, he called me a sociopath. Which, what? Like, you're right. I saw that video. Not everyone's a sociopath, Shane. Just because you had a fake ass therapist on your series that was whatever that got sounds like he's a sociopath. If anyone is, like, for and also, he called me a pathological liar and a sociopath to Peter Mon because Peter Mon's like, Oh, yeah, Trisha said she wants to hang out. And he's like, Well, she's a pathological liar. I was like, I had nothing to do. It's not like I said, Oh, Shane's like this. And he had also, to like, himself. nothing prompted him to t talk shit behind you. She, he wasn't like, Can I trust her? He, he, she's like, Oh, I'm hanging out with her. He's like, Oh, cool. I love her. She's one of my best friends. You'll have a good time. It's like, No, she's a pathological liar. That was. It's like, sorry. And I hung out with Peter Mon after that. So clearly I wasn't a pathological liar because I did want to hang out with him. It was insane to me. Like that to me was the scariest thing. Like you expect it from Jeffrey. Jeffrey, once again, is going to get off the hook with this because he's a mean girl. He's known for that. That's his MO. I think he kind of likes mm. it. Shane, however, is a little two-faced snake. Rylan is also a little two-faced snake. And I don't, you know, I honestly would rather be best friends with Jeffrey than have to see them ever again. Well, at least you know what to expect with Jeffrey. That's what I'm saying. Because like you said, he's just he's just a douche. That's just one, his defining characteristic as a human being. I get it. Hey, I mean, I get yeah. that. I respect it more, you know? Hmm. I should have known because everyone has these issues with him. I should have known. Shane. But Shane, the, the so-called... Uh, what what is empath. it? Was? Yeah, the empath. This fucking cracks me no up. No one can call you can't call yourself an empath. That's like saying I'm a good person. Like you you just you can't just say that. You're obviously not if you have to say that you are. It's like people call themselves rich. Like if you have well, to call yourself rich, you're not rich. You're, like, you're clearly not an empath by saying that. No. So anyway. Honestly, don't care. Honestly, I'm so over it. Like, don't disable your comments. You're a fucking coward. Like Okay, so wait, let me give a time. Could you imagine if we disable comments on front of me's? Oh no. Like, what's the point of no, the show, listen, then? I've been like, shit on. I've been through drama. I've been through the ringer. Disabling comments and likes is like the one thing you don't do because it's like Yeah, it so is. It's like, dude, you are such a fuck. It's like, holy shit. You gotta just own it, bruh. Oh God. Because the whole thing on the his thing too, like addressing it was that like I'm sorry, Trish can't express herself to us. Bitch, when have I ever had a problem expressing myself to anyone? I'm expressing myself right now, like I did to you. You're a little weasel. She, if anything, she overexpressed. Dude. That's what I'm saying. You, she's Especially the world's fastest talker. <laughs> you know what I mean? She got words per minute. She'll express her ass into oh, a fucking I was so into pissed. a coma. I'm shocked, but honestly, I'm in shock. I'm just in shock by it. And honestly, like, don't give a fuck. So can I? Sh let's show the people what you're doing. Show me the butter. <laughs> so well, is a that process? This is this is hard to spread. I usually so is that going down butter. on the grill or is that on the yeah. inside? Okay. You gotta grease it up. Yeah, yeah. I'm just making sure. I just want to know what's going well, on here. This is kind of hard to spread because usually I use. I can't believe it's not butter. Um, I um, once had Fabio in a music video. Can somebody plug in our our George Foreman? I once had Fabio in a music video, and he said every time someone says I can't believe it's not butter, he tells me he gets like thirty thousand dollars. I don't think that's why. Does, that's Fabio's line. You remember he did all those commercials? I like, can't believe it's not butter. Oh. And so he told me we did a music video in Maui together like a year ago, and he was just like every time someone says that you have to pay me thirty thousand dollars. So You're I just right. said it twice. So I guess we owe him sixty thousand. Yeah, I'm not paying you shit, Fabio. Come for me. That might fucker. be true. It's not true. You don't think? I can't believe it's not butter, Fabio. Come get me. Ninety thousand. <laughs> 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 I'm going to go bankrupt saying I can't believe it's not butter. So anyway, um, let me let me give a time. And thank you for not using their name in the title, although I did see that H3 Live, you guys used Shane's name. In the oh, but that, but that <laughs> doesn't include you. What did I say? Oh, I said Shane exposed himself or something. So many Shane ones. I was like, okay. I mean, it's fine. Whatever. I don't care. I literally I figured because you weren't in it. 
it was fine because I was respecting you. <laughs> but we're still now. I'm part of the H3. Oh, Empire. the the extended universe. Did we really call one Shane himself? Yes, Dan. <laughs> Shane. Yes, we really did. Um. Yeah, uh, that's how we do it around here. <laughs> Shane exposed. Himself. Yeah, and I don't mean and and what's what's interesting is what you guys didn't hear is that he sh- he actually exposed himself to children. No, I'm kidding. He didn't do that. Oh, I was like, but hey, guess what? They <laughs> lie, so just lie. Yeah. No one's getting in trouble with lying anymore, <laughs> yeah. so just say okay, whatever wait. you want to say. Okay, let me give the timeline. So Rylan addressed Trisha on this podcast. He said he was confused and taken aback. We haven't watched this together. Let's watch it. Oh, my God. This While you're sense. cooking. So because... let's watch all these drama, these vid- not drama videos. Let's watch these weasel mother, these sick sadists no this is drama look how happy he is that rylan's like someone's actually talking about me well, what am i doing i'm like a fucking yeah like, oh my god homeless <laughs> weirdo no it's like your bread has tourettes <laughs> it's kind of funny <laughs> my bread has tourettes can you want to explain what that means that's like your physical that's like the bread's version of your hand you know when you have your tourettes because you were doing that right this is what i look like as a human being according to trisha just crumbs eviscerated it's fun though like it's fun when you like knowing that we're like cool and friends like it's fun to have someone like tourettes just like <laughs> moses is like my middle eastern you're my tourettes friend. you like having tokens around yeah but i'm like a token like mental case i'm the token right, fat person right, 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 i'm right. the token like you know there's like a lot of token things about me right so like i've never talk- been a token i'm a token jew i mean so is so is there's too many of those now i have too many token jews yeah i mean life. la's token <laughs> jew you got you basically yeah. you've, you i don't i never had a problem with Tourette's though so i do think it's kind of cool because it's like fun we can make Tourette jokes about the bread and stuff i mean you're making all the jokes <laughs> and i'm not sure they even make sense but I'm, i don't take offense oh is it offensive no i don't take offense but would people take offense to that if it wasn't you i don't think some so. mate I, don't, I think it's cute. I think it's a cute thing. When I watch your H3 Live, I was like, oh, I know what this is. It's Tourette's. Right. I like being to able to identify things. Like this non-binary thing that I am now. You know, when I thought I was like transgender, like I'm like, I'm like full, full, like, what is the word they say? No cap. No cap. I love that there's non-binary out there. I did not know that was a thing. You Non-binary means you can like switch genders. You can be two genders. Genders. Oh, should we? Let's put this in. Anyways, I love this new woke world where we have labels on things. I need to know what I am and I like it. We need to identify them so that we can is that okay? joke on them. Yeah, it's just heating up. Okay. Okay.